Look at this. I'm on a bridge that is closed. And this is as far as you can go. This is the creek as it runs out of town. Along the outer edges of the town actually. And uh, this is where everything ends up. That's that side. Let me go look at the other side. This is the other side. Now look, you know if there's a chair in there, there's going to be potential for fun stuff. Look at that. All the way up through there. Looks like it might get pretty deep though. I don't know. I'm going to find out. I'm in. So far I've seen a pretty good bit of stuff. There's some other water pipes where some junk comes out. There's a bridge. That is the end of a road. A little bit of trash tied up on here. Now I gotta figure out which way I'm gonna go. I usually like to go the opposite way the water's flowing. So because that way I don't stir up everything behind me. So I may head this way depending on how deep it gets. Let's see. This isn't the cleanest water in the world, but it has a lot of fish in it. It's just it's just not that clean because you can kind of see it kind of gets stuck right there over the little waterfall. But that looks like a horseshoe with an oddball shape on it. That is not a horseshoe with an oddball shape. Huh. That's nothing. Boy, it's really pretty in here. Falls here. It was in the 60s this morning. There's something shining right there. What is that? I think my magnet ain't picking it up. Ah, fishing reel. Let me get it off there and get it cleaned up to. It is a South Bend reel. That's an old one. 50s, maybe 60s, maybe earlier. I don't know. The line looks like it's uh, maybe a material instead of nylon. So it is a little older one. I bet there's some bottle dumps up in here too. This water is interesting. It's about knee deep all the way. It's going to get a little freaky walking through all those leaves up there in knee deep water. But which can there's an old power pole under here with the old insulator on it. I don't know if my magnet will get a big enough hook on that stuff. Look at that. See the pole? That's neat, isn't it? I assume they just unscrew off there. I may make an attempt on my way back. I unscrewed that thing. You may, you may not believe this and I kind of don't that looks like another gun I can't tell if it's real though maybe a big old pellet gun you see it I can't get to it it's kind of far out there maybe wooden ah oh, my magnet's not sticking to it it's not a good sign crap Unless it's an aluminum toy. Dang it, it may be a toy. Where'd it go? There it is. Ah, crap, it is. It's plastic. How are you gonna play a brother? Look at that. Man, I was hoping that was real. Sheesh. I don't know if you can see all the stuff under the water. Try to look through my glasses.
Now look at the difference. It's kind of a reflection. All right, let me find something else. There's going to be. Some All right, I'm under the under the highway again. I see different things down here. I sure wish I could find a gun. Another one, a real one. That was disappointing, huh? I thought that Jekyll was going to be real. What you talking about? All right, I'm going to look up through here. I'm not sure how far I'll go. Modern trash. A little bit of everything down here. This is right outside the heart of the city. So if you were going to throw something off the bridge to get rid of it, you would hope it would land right here and be washed away forever. Until somebody like me comes down here and plucks it out of the water. This kind of stuff I'm pulling out. you got to remember, a lot of Alabama, especially outside of Birmingham and all around, was heavy iron forging and melting and all those other words. I don't know about iron one on around this area. So if I drag the magnet through there, it fills up really quick with just metal dust so let me get up in here let me clean a magnet off and drag it a little bit more see I did it again I thought I was recording and I found this DVD right here Wild Things Kevin Bacon Matt Dillon here those other people are. It's in there. Right next to the speaker. Oh, that's actually a fan. Uh, maybe it was a speaker. I don't know. No desire to watch that. Look at that. I did get the... Uh... Oh, it's broken. I did get the brown one off. Right after I said I'd come back and get it later, it actually unscrewed with ease. That's got to be just a piece of a bottle. Boy, that joker's thick. You couldn't get a lot of coconut. Oh, I got ants running around my camera. Here's another movie. Let's see what this is. Hmm. Before the devil knows you're dead. All time family classic right there. It's getting a little funky in here. Now I am completely under the highway. There's a bird watching me. I think he gave me the bird. I'm going to walk over here. Let's look on the other side of this. There's a lot of stuff. I might have to come back here and bring my friend with me to, we can parallel play in the creek. I'm so far out. There's not even any graffiti, but look. There's another shoe. Remember I told you there's a shoe in every creek? In every city creek, there's a little bottle. I can't read it. Let me get it out of here a little further away. All right, here it is. It says Listerine Lambert Pharmaceuticals. So I don't think it's that old. I don't know how long Listerine's been around. There's a helmet. I found the guy's boots over there, remember? Or one of his boots. Got it trash up there. This is up the side of the mountain. Next to where I found this bottle. I got to wonder if there might be some more bottles up in there. Another winter project, huh? If you're not afraid to get your feet wet in the winter, I'm not. This spot is where the junk stops here. I want to get over there, but this is really deep. So I got to like step over and see what all is wrapped around this pole. I thought I saw a grip to a pistol a minute ago, but I didn't. Working load, 150 pounds. 
Okay. Purple too. Got like purple. I'll wear that this season. Just pulled out that gear. It's getting pretty deep right there. Man, I know there's something in there. Boy, there's a lot of big old rubber mats in there. And there's a bumper off of mercury. I'm gonna buy me a mercury. Cruise it up down the road. Boy, that's a shady looking situation, isn't it? All right, I'm gonna head down into the murkiness. All right, y'all ready to identify? That's a bed liner. It is not something else. This is a bottle I just pulled out of the mud. It has the H on it. On the bottom it says property of Coca-Cola Bottling Company. And on the bottom it has an E or it could be a C. Like I said, the H is laying on one side. Maybe it's J-E. Maybe it's J-H-E. But it does say property of Coca-Cola on it. Anyway, anyone got any info on that? Help me out. The train came up and stopped beside me. It was loud, but then it turned dead silence for about the past 30 minutes. And then it let some air out of one of the brakes and about gave me a stinking heart murmur. Check out this bottle I found. It says Chiro Cola, six and a half blood ounces. This bottle is never sold. I've never seen one of those. And on the bottom, I don't know what it says. What is that one? Anyone recognize the Chiro Cola? Never heard of that. I put it in my man purse. I'm going to keep walking. I wasn't going to pick it up because it looks like a beer bottle and it was brown when I picked it up. But I picked it up. Crap, that scared the crap out of me again. I gotta file a complaint with somebody. Alright, I'm heading upstream still. I'm actually gonna get out and walk those tracks back to my truck because it's a long, doggone way in this creek. And these rocks are slick. God, there's so much stuff in here. I picked up so much stuff that I hadn't recorded that I pretty much assumed it was junk. There's no hubcap. You know what those are. I'm not a hubcap guy. I used to not be a bottle guy. But I'm getting pretty excited about these. Uh oh, I'm hooked on to some stuff. I'm dragging my magnet behind me as I walk. I want to find a bottle so y'all can see. I mean, you probably know what a green bottle looks like underwater. Sorry, my magnet got hung up. So I'll wait until I find stuff. All right, I'm gonna turn it off and walk up there. It's getting a little swampy up here now. Check this out. Let's pull it off the bottom. It says Master Publications Appliance Repair Manuals. And it's two-sided, if that matters. I don't know if it's old or not. I know y'all want me to carry it out of here. Man, I don't want to carry that joker all the way out. But I may come back and get it. I don't know if that's a credit card or business card your club your choice silver I can't read it silver 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 rewards okay we'll let that fly out right there let's add a little color back to the water I'm up in the nowhere zone now I'm breathing hard because I'm getting tired. I've been a long way and it's a heck of a long walk back. And I don't want to walk it in this creek all the way. So I'm going to go up there. But if that thing blows air when I'm right next to it, it's, I'm probably going to have a 
thinking aneurysm or something. I don't know what's going to happen. It might not be good. I did bring the sign though. It's going to stay right there until I walk back by. I just can't quit going. I could walk from here to thinking Tennessee or whatever state I come out of. It's hard to tell. They come out in the Gulf of Mexico. All right. I'm going up. Actually, I'm going upstream, so I'm not going to come out in the Gulf of Mexico. No need to correct me. Here's a gear. I was going to pick it up with a magnet, but then I got to have two hands to pull it back off with. It's a big gear for something. No more bottles yet. A lot of car parts up in here. I guess they wash from wherever they wash from. There's a hood off a car. You know there's a snake in that joker. There's a beauty ring off the headlight. That's back when there were beauty rings and they were metal. Now everything is plastic. The whole car's made of plastic. But that's alright, they're kind of more efficient. More efficient, get better gas mileage, it's better for the everybody else. Oh, these rocks are really slippery. I'm almost done. It's getting soggy. I just want to look in this last pool and then I'm turning around. 